Let us start work now. Take your English book and notebook. You need your pencils too. The topic is detective in the town. You need four page 46. Have you ever watched a movie, TV show, or series about it? Maybe like Sherlock Holmes? Did you know another? We're going to talk about events that happened in the past tense. Let's see the picture in your book. We have some places and dates too. Beauty salon. Could you see the beauty salon? Coffee shop. Garage. Who is in the garage? Emma, right? Movie theater. Who is in the movie theater? Kevin, right? Sport field. Who was in the sport field? Rick. When? On Monday? Right. Theme park. Who was in the theme park? Pam? No, right? Dead. Very good. Where was Pam on Thursday at 4 o'clock? Pay attention in the red word, was. If you see was, we are talking about the past. Pam was at the beauty salon. When? On Thursday. At what time? At 4 o'clock. Where was Rick on Monday at 10 o'clock? Could you tell me? Rick was at the sport field. Great. The structure. Past continuous tense. Listen and read. Pay close attention in the red words. I was playing hockey. I wasn't playing hockey. Let's change this sentence in a question. Were you playing hockey? Yes, I was. Or no, I wasn't. We have here positive answer and negative answer. This is a line of time. Now, today, the future and the past tense. Past continuous is an activity that begins in the past and another activity stops it. The structure in our sentence will be subject or person, the verb to be in past tense was a word, the verb plus ing or the action word, and then the complement that tells us where it's happening. Here we have an example. I was dancing at home. I, subject, was the verb to be in past tense, verb plus ing, dancing, and the complement at home. Let's change this in a question. Were you dancing at home? Positive answer, yes I was. Negative answer, no I wasn't. No I was not. Contraction or without contraction, both are correct. Another example. She was cooking at, at the kitchen. Let's change this into a question. Only we're going to change the places of the verb to be and the subject. Was she cooking at the kitchen? Yes, she was. Or in negative form, no, she wasn't. Look, here we have the contractions. No, it was not. No, she wasn't. Was not, wasn't. Both are correct. Let's work in the note. Page 47, activity 7. Make seven long sentences, use a day and a time in each sentence. We have a scheduling time. I'm gonna make you an example using the day of Sunday. Sarah was at the movie theater on Sunday at 7 p.m. Use the structure. Now is your turn. Make this in your note. The next activity, you have to send me an audio answering this question, positive or negative form. Yes, I was or no, I wasn't. Were you playing video games? Were you dancing in your room? Were you eating pizza? Thank you. Any question, you can find me at WhatsApp.
Remember, stay at home. Keep distance between people. And wash your hands. See you in the next class. Bye.